Why what an ounce? Why a Ukrainian national is here talking shit online when he isn't at home fighting for his countrymen, fighting for his fighting for his family? You should be you should be wearing that top, right? Because that's an army shirt and you're not part of the fucking army. It's funny how the Jews are the only ones who don't call Ukraine. It's only the pro Russians who say that. Right, if you ask me a silly question, I answer with a silly answer. Oh, wait there, wait, 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 and your ears stood on a fucking stool, talking shit online. That's what I want to know. No, no, it's a serious question, I want a serious answer. I don't know. What I'm doing for Ukraine right now, what's the point of me doing this right now? Look in the mirror. It means look at yourself. You individuals such as yourself are the only reason why Russia is still holding on. Mr. Howard, have you ever lied in any public statement? Certainly not. Right now, you individuals, you're very brainwashed by the Russian Certainly. propaganda. I note you're not answering the question. I want to know. I, I, no, no. I, 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 I want to know. I want to know why a Ukrainian national is here talking shit online when he isn't at home fighting for his countrymen, fighting for his, fighting for his family. Right? No, no, no. No, that's all I want to know. I want a serious answer. Why aren't you? Because I am a uh, in Ukraine, fighting for your country. Yeah, that's why. Because answer the question. Don't say all oh, this. No, all right. Because I'm a lady. No, answer it. Answer it. Because I am a lady. Do you want? Because I am a lady. Because you're a fucking coward. That's why you're a coward. And the truth, of, to overrule the, the truth of the matter is that Mr. Marriott was not suspended. Did I did not. to overrule him? I did not. I, 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 I would sick myself if I had been a traitor. But I couldn't turn my back. I couldn't turn my back on Ukraine. I couldn't turn my back on Ukraine. I I I I back on Ukraine. Look you up. This is all you're doing. It's talking shit on Ukraine. It's all you're doing. talking shit. Yeah, you're right. I spoke to you two weeks ago. I spoke to you two weeks ago and you've been here you've been here for over a year talking shit right? get in your homeland get in your homeland and fight for your country get in your homeland don't come here and talk shit on the school you think they're making a good point right? well, my point is why aren't you home why aren't you home are you silencing the free speech he's been weak for the last year and a half so what are you I'm not sorry I don't want to answer that whether you threatened to over Rule him. The, the important aspect of this, which it's very clear to bear in mind, I wanted to answer it. I'm sorry, I'm not, I'm not stopping from talking. I'm not stopping from talking. I'm calling him a fucking coward. He did not overrule Derek Did you threaten to overrule him? I He's a coward. He's a coward. Did you threaten to overrule him, Mr. Howard? I just left because it's funny to me. You're a coward. Did you threaten to overrule him? You're a coward. You're not coming here for a discussion. You're not coming here. I had a discussion with you two weeks ago, Pablo. I had a discussion with you two weeks ago. You're a fucking Cowards. You're, 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 you're sad, you're talking shit online, talking shit online, when you should be at home. You should be at home. Why are you fighting? Why are you home? Every single day, and you will still not be Give me an answer. With respect, that is not answering the question of whether you threatened to overrule him. Yes. Answer one to what? Question, one question. Why am I here? Why are you not at home? Because it's Why important to country? be here to explain to people flag? such as Ex yourself. But, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> Explain to me oh, what? We don't I don't want to know why aren't you fighting in your country. I don't want to know any of this. No, exactly it's not talking about We're not talking about Putin. We're not talking about Zelensky. We're talking about why aren't you at home fighting for your country and your family and your countrymen? You think this is fighting for your country? Talking shit online. You think this is it? This ain't it. This ain't it. That's right. With respect, you haven't asked the question. Tell you where you are. You're a fucking coward. You're a fucking coward.
coward. So you are, you're a fucking coward. Hold on, so you don't want to send tax money to Ukraine, but you would send a taxpayer to Ukraine. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, so you're a citizen. That makes so much sense, my friends. Answer, taxes to Ukraine. answer this way. Send all the taxes to Ukraine. Answer this way. Because if you refuse to answer... Right. Uh, we'll, leave, we'll leave that aspect there. And move on to this question. To this question. What else can the Western countries do to help what else Ukraine? Can the West do? Very good question. The West can provide Ukraine with all the armaments they need. Because for now, the West has not provided everything. All right, you want all the armaments. My message to you is very simple. Uh, thank you to uh, um, Mr. Putin for the Ukrainian people. Thank you to Mr. Putin for the Ukrainians what they need. Give them the weapons. We rely wholly on heroes such as the people who are here tonight with us from the Azov Brigade. For who? For other Ukrainians to fight while you see East Brooklyn? Oh my God, you, you are a funny guy. Yeah, 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 we're getting the planes, we're getting the tanks, we're getting the armament needed to end this war once and for all. I love to read some of the summits of non case TV. Some of them think that I'm an Asian. Some of them think I'm a Syrian Jew. 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 Some of them think you know, countrymen. Do you support? Do you support what he's all about? Look, and you're wearing all the gear as well. Look, and you're wearing all the Ukrainian gear, but you're, you're in London talking shit online. Talking shit online, you coward. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Fucking coward. You're a proper gutter person, I see. I should not have you No, I've been. I, mean, I come down here. I, I, I come down here six years ago. I'm known. I, I see you online, I see you online all the time. You talk quiet shit down, all the time. No, no, you quiet down. Don't tell me to quiet down. Who the fuck are you to tell me to quiet down? A coward. A coward that should be fighting his own country. That's what it should be, eh? But you're a coward. You're a coward. You're a coward. I had a debate with him, and he did not act like a complete I don't. I'm not David Clunes. I'm not David Clunes. Yeah, I know you're not. Exactly. So why are you comparing me to David Clunes? There's no good and bad here. Everybody's a bad guy in a war. Yeah, but there's no, but there's nonsense that you claim are the good there guys, was, but was, nobody else thinks that. Nobody else in the world thinks that. Because you're not worth jack. Ah, oh, right. And David Clues actually came to me. You, we asked, you know, we asked one question. question. You know, when I was discussing with David Clues over there, of uh, one of the, <laughs> exactly, exactly, Clues indeed, uh, of, uh, of the, the conspiracy theories over there, but there was something that just kept happening over and over again, which is jumping from one argument to another. Why are you in the foreign country instead of back at home fighting for your countrymen? Answer it. Answer the question. Answer I'm an agent. This is what we have to deal with every single time. Every single time. The Russo files. Who's mentioned Putin? Who's mentioned Putin? The CIA word though, isn't it? He's calling him CIA. All the first words. When somebody comes to you and tells you, what do you think about the war in Ukraine? What do you think we could do to stop it? You can either answer the question and say what you think, or if you know that you don't have a good answer, you could just avoid the question altogether. And this is what happens with people who are very skeptical about the pro-Ukrainian movement. Right? And you won't answer it. Answer the question. Why aren't you back in your homeland fighting for your country? Do you threaten to overrule him? Talk it. Here he I'm an agent. I'm an agent. I can give you so much answer. Yeah. I know why. Because you're a coward. You're a coward. This is a lovely flag. This is a flag of You're a coward. One of their uh, protesters was asked, if Germany was invaded, would you not want some international help to help you defend yourself? You know what he answered to that question? He completely avoided it. Because he knew that he could not answer.
Yeah, you're a coward. I tell you what, I'd be petrified if I had to fight. But I would fight. I wouldn't talk. I wouldn't talk shit in a foreign country. I wouldn't. No, no, no. Nothing to be. Nothing to be afraid. You're a big man to call names. War. You should be afraid of war. But you seem to talk about war and death online like it's some sort of joke. Your own countrymen are dying in droves. No, no. I'm just. I'm just jumping on you because you just talk shit on shit. Oh, yeah. Because you have mental issues yeah. and you come here... Are you crazy, man, talking country. shit in London? Why are you That's in the foreign country instead of back at home fighting for your countrymen? Answer it. Answer the question. Answer, I'm an agent. <laughs> this <laughs> is what we have to deal with every single time. The Russo files. Russo files. All the bad words. They know, they know, they know. Just one word. Just one word. Pavlov, you're a coward. You're a coward. This is my CIA microphone. You're a coward. Every time. Right. Seriously, simple question. To look in the camera and answer this. Excellent. Why are you not fighting for your country? Go. Yeah. Why?